Hi, my name is Dave Steinson, and I'm the Executive Director at Haycock Camping Ministries. I'm excited to join you today and share with you a future vision for camp. In 1959, a group representing nearly 80 churches throughout the tri-state area shared a vision for a local camp where Christ could be proclaimed, specifically to the boys they were working with in their programs. In the fall of 1961, the Lord guided them to a farm property in northern Bucks County, Pennsylvania. With no established history, area banks were reluctant to lend funds for the purchase of the land. So 10 men signed a $20,000 bond pledging their own assets as security for the loan to obtain a mortgage for the property. These 10 men took an incredible step of faith knowing that God was able to take their personal sacrifice and do an amazing work on the grounds of Haycock Camp for generations to come. So in the summer of 1963, a one-week camping session was held at this new property. The boys and their leaders slept in tents and pop-up camping trailers and ate meals under a large surplus army tent. From these humble beginnings almost 60 years ago until today, Haycock has held true to its mission of providing Christ-centered camping experiences with a passion for growing boys into godly men. Camp's facilities have changed a lot since that first week of sleeping in tents, but our purpose is the same, to lead people to Christ and train them to serve Him. Over the past 10 years, we have seen God at work in great facility improvements at camp, including new bathhouses, renovated cabins, a climbing tower, a new swimming pool, and worship pavilion. Most importantly, these facility changes combined with a staff and board who are passionate about our mission, has led to incredible program growth. Between 2013 and 2019, we have more than doubled the number of people served on our property during a calendar year. Over the past few years, the leadership of Haycock has also been prayerfully investing in the future vision of the ministry of Haycock and our property. The board of directors established a master plan committee to head up this task and an engineering firm was hired to conduct, conduct an extensive feasibility study and site survey on our property. After years of prayer, land studies, and discussions, we are ready to give you a glimpse of our initial master site plan for the future of Haycock Camping Ministries. Our vision involves the development of three separate campuses on our property that can operate simultaneously. These new facilities will nearly triple the number of campers that we can serve in each week of summer camp. They will also open the door for Haycock to better minister to churches, youth groups, and our local community in the non-summer months. So, please take a tour with me and see what we believe God has in store for the future of Haycock. The land that you see when you first enter camp will experience the most extensive development in our master plan. This lower camp area is currently used as our game fields, maintenance area, and is where our camp office and staff houses are located. Our site survey showed that this was the most suitable land for development and program growth. Our plan is to develop Lower Camp into a fully functional day camp for up to 150 kids per day during the summer months. It will also serve as an ideal location for retreats during the fall, winter, and spring months with an enclosed gym facility that supports gathering, sleeping, and dining together. The addition of athletic fields and a gymnasium also opens the door for sports leagues and other community events. In our virtual tour, you see our plan is to build a new office at the entrance of camp to accommodate the increased year-round staff that will be needed to operate camp with our anticipated growth. On the left, we see a new pond that will be excavated next to our current office. This body of water is the first big step in our master plan. This pond has been designed by our engineers to meet the stormwater regulations that will be required for us to add our new facilities to the camp property. To your right, we see the location of our proposed multi-purpose gymnasium, the central building at Lower Camp. Next to the gym, we will add multiple outdoor pavilion areas, a playground, and regulation softball and soccer fields. Towards the top of the fields, we will add activity areas like slingshot, beginning archery, and horses. Coming down the road from these activities, we see outdoor basketball courts and our relocated maintenance buildings. Plans are to build a splash park that will be perfect for young campers and adjacent to this will be an enclosed building complete with bathrooms, camp store, and our nurse's station. As development continues, the current office building, maintenance barn, and staff houses will be repurposed to better meet the program needs of lower camp. 
Heading up the road, we will now leave lower camp and head towards the upper camp locations. Upper Camp North is the heart of our camping ministry right now and has been extensively developed for decades. Our plan for this campus is to specifically serve kids ages 7 to 12 in the summer. God has blessed Haycock in recent years and has enabled us to renovate or replace almost every building in this location. While Upper Camp North is mostly complete, the master plan does show future plans to add additional stockade cabins, move new staff housing to an area of camp that will be more secluded, add activity ranges, and build a multi-purpose expansion to the dining hall. When fully complete, we will be able to serve up to 125 summer campers per week at this location. This campus will also remain as our primary location for the Stand Discipleship Program, our many parent-child camps, and other specialty camp programming. We now head to another location with the possibility for extensive growth, Upper Camp South. This currently is our outdoor camping area that has our lean-to sites as well as our climbing tower and high ropes elements. In our virtual tour, we see that we will develop this area with buildings specifically designed for Haycock's wilderness programming for teen boys and our leadership growth program. We will add more lean-to sites and activity areas geared for teen guys like paintball, shotguns, rifles, and archery. Other improvements will be to build group meeting facilities such as outdoor worship and dining pavilions, a second lodge building for additional staff, and a multi-purpose building. Lastly, we will add single unit cabins that will house eight to 10 people, the perfect size for our teen adventure camp programs. Overall, this area will be able to accommodate up to 140 teen campers plus our required summer staff every week. In the off season, it will be a great location for retreats that accommodate both an indoor and outdoor focus. We know this is a big vision, but we also know that God is able. Your prayers for camp as we move forward with this master plan would be greatly appreciated. We will be working through the permit approval process soon and communicating more with you in the future about the next steps including the, su the support that will be needed from our Haycock family to see this dream become a reality. I hope that this brief tour filled you with excitement about the future of Haycock Camping Ministries. God has certainly blessed this ministry in the past and present, and we are eagerly anticipating how we will use this master plan to impact future generations for Christ.